Hey, 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 what's up, you guys? Good to meet us here. Hope you guys are doing fantastically well. Welcome to Financial Freedom TV. And today I wanted to talk about taking a punch. <laughs> so if you're watching a replay of this video, please do me a massive favor and stick hashtag replay into the comments. If you're brand new, if you're watching one of my videos for the first time, please do say new in the comments as well. would love to say hi and welcome you to the tribe. And if you get value from this video, feel free to share it. Maybe somebody else will find it interesting too or tag them into the comments below. So what do I mean about learning to take a punch? Well, I'm not talking about literally being punched in the face, but sometimes that happens too in our lives. But this is more to do about a life throwing punches at you, especially when you're building your business, right? Uh, you know, I've been in network marketing in the home-based business for the last 11 years, and boy, did I get some punches. <laughs> and if you're going to do this long enough, I promise you, you will get punched too. You know, these punches come in various shapes and forms. Sometimes it's a team leader, uh, you know, leaving your team. Uh, sometimes it's the company making a change. Sometimes, you know, some financial difficulties, sometimes some health issues, etc. But, you know, uh, like the Murphy's Law says, whatever can go wrong will go wrong. And at some point in your business career, you will also get going to get some challenges. And these challenges sometimes are so big are so huge that the only thing you want to do is just throw in the towel, you know, like in the boxing ring when they throw in the white towel, that's it, game over. You know, they stop the match and they drag the person off the ring because that's it, you know, they give up. So in life and in business, sometimes we also, uh, you know, uh, get in a corner and we want to throw in that towel because we feel like we are done. But uh, they say that God never sends you a problem that is too big for you to handle, right? If you get a problem, that means you are big enough to handle that problem. And sometimes they say that opportunities, they come wrapped up in problems. And whether you're going to unwrap this problem or not will determine if you're worthy of the gift that is inside, right? And they say that in every challenge, in every uh, problem, there is a lesson, right? And sometimes it's not easy. You know, when you're having a challenge, when you're having a problem, uh, recently I had one thing that really was, you know, stressing me out and really, you know, bothering me. Um, and, you know, I stopped for a second and I thought, well, what's the lesson in this thing? You know, and I was dealing with one company that is very uh, difficult to deal with, you know, and I thought, well, the lesson here is how not to do customer service because these guys drove me mad and I would never wish anything like that onto my customer, right? So that's a lesson in it, right? I, I want to make sure that my customer service is never so horrendous as this company's because they literally got me to a point where I just want to, you know, sue them. I just want to report them or do something because it's just impossible, right? So, but every problem, every challenge has something like that. There's going to be a lesson hidden. But the question is whether you're going to just uh, throw a tantrum, you know, and, and, and go, oh, this is unfair. Oh, this is horrible, right? Or you're going to stop for a second and think, okay, this, this sucks. This is not great, and I'm not enjoyed. I didn't enjoy that experience either. But let's set that on the side and think: What can I learn from that? What, how can this help me? You know, for the rest of my life, for my future. How could this even make me money? Right? Because sometimes when you find the lesson in the problem, that lesson makes you money. It changes your business. It changes how how uh, you behave, etc. Right? So. Um, understand that there will be punches and learn to take a punch. You know, if, if life, you know, throws you a punch, if business throws you a punch, just take it. Be a big boy or a big girl and, and don't just, you know, fall on the ground and stay there, you know, like Sylvester Stallone in Rocky said, you know, life will put you on your knees permanently, you know, if you allow it to. So the fact is you have to keep getting up and getting up and getting up after every single one of these punches. Uh, and before you know it, you'll be much closer to your results and you'll be much closer to your dreams because you never gave up. And that's my advice for you, my friends. I uh, hope you got value from this. If you did, feel free to share it. Have a great rest of your evening and I'll see you at the top. Bye for now.